Hello Ignite, how are you? I hope you've had a good week so far and I hope you have been able to play outside a bit this week. It's a shame the snow has gone but we have had some sunshine not just rain which has been nice. So this week we are going to start a new story and this story is in the Old Testament which it means it's stories before Jesus was born. And the story we're going to be looking at is about a boy called Joseph. And this story is found in the book of Genesis, which is the very first book of the Bible. So it happened a long, 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 long time before Jesus was born. So today's our first um, day of the se series, and we're going to be looking at it over a few weeks. So we're going to start the story today. So when you're ready, here we go. If you want to watch the story on here, you can, or you can watch some of the videos that are below. Okay, here we go. Now, Joseph lived in a land called Canaan, and he had 12 brothers. His dad, his father, was called Jacob. And Jacob loved Joseph more than any of his other sons. One day, Jacob gave Joseph a very special coat. It was a beautiful coat and it had many colours. But this made Joseph's brothers very jealous. They wished they could have new coats too. And they were a bit angry. One night, Joseph had a special dream. He told his brothers about it. He said, we were in the field gathering up grain and corn and my grain stood up and all of your bunches of corn bowed down to mine. And then the next night he had another dream. And in this dream, he told his brothers again that the sun, the moon, 11 stars bowed down to him but his brothers were not happy about these dreams. They were very jealous. They wanted to get rid of Joseph. So one day when they were out in the fields farming, they sold him to some traders who were traveling to far away lands. They took away his coat and they threw him in a pit. First of all, they wanted to kill him, but then they decided they were going to sell him and make some money from this. So the traders took Joseph far away to a land called Egypt. God was still watching over Joseph. Joseph's brothers went home and they took his coat and they had torn it all up and dipped it in blood. They told their father that Joseph had been eaten by a wild animal. Joseph's father, Jacob, was very sad. You can see he's crying. Very, very sad. But when Joseph got to Egypt, he was sold to a very rich man and his name was Potiphar. And he was sold to this man to be his slave. So Potiphar kept Joseph and made Joseph work for him in his house in Egypt. Now, that's as far as we're going to go today in the story. I wonder what you think about the story so far. So this boy, Joseph, his dad loved him more than any of his other, brother, other sons, which probably wasn't a good thing to do because really, mums and dads love all of their children the same amount. They don't have any favourites. And then his brothers were angry and jealous. And some days you might be a bit angry or a bit jealous because somebody might have a toy that you want or have something that you want. I wonder what you do. Do you get upset? Do you cry? Do you stamp your foot? I don't know. But what, what did Joseph's brothers do? They tried to get rid of Joseph. Now, I'm sure that if you're jealous, you're not going to try and get rid of your friends or people that have got something that you want. That's not a good thing to do. But when we feel like that, we need to tell God that we feel angry and we feel jealous. And we need to pray and ask God to help us and that God to be with us. 
And in this story, as we go through the weeks, we're going to learn about how God was with Joseph all the time. And this was all part of God's plan. So I'm going to leave it there for this week. You can watch some of the videos and some of the cartoons. There's loads of stories, versions of this story on YouTube if you want to watch them. So let's say a little prayer and then I will speak to you again soon. Dear God, thank you that you look after us no matter where we are or what we are doing. God, thank you that even when Joseph was thrown into the pit, that you were with him. And that even when he went to Egypt, you were with him and you had plans for him. God, help us when we are angry and when we are jealous. Help us not to feel angry or jealous, but to be able to tell you how we feel and ask you to help us. And help us to have a good week this week and not feel angry or jealous of other people. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. I hope to speak to you again soon. Take care. Bye-bye.